Hello and welcome to Kit's Garden, episode 2. Um, it is the 22nd of March 2017. In this episode I am going to sow some tomato seeds. I will show you step by step how I sow them. And I will give you an update of the seeds which I showed you in the last episode. And then I will take you out into the garden for a quick update and I'll show you my grapevine and some roses. Okay, so let's get started with sowing the tomato seeds. Uh, the variety that which I'm growing this year is called Marmondi. Marmondi. It is an outdoor tomato. It's specially designed to be better outside. So I'll, sh I'll try and show you the packet. That's the variety I'm growing this year. <clears throat> I'm going to do four pots. I'm going to fill them with compost. This is seed compost. It doesn't have to be any old multi-purpose compost is fine. This compost I'm using is actually cocoa compost. It's made from the fibre from around the coconut so it doesn't have many nutrients in it at all and it's perfect for starting off seeds and it's also sterile so you don't get any bugs or fungus or anything growing in it and fill the pops up not all the way probably About three quarters, leave about an inch at the top. Sorry if my camera's not focusing, I don't know what's wrong with it today. I'm trying to get it to focus. There we go. Right. So we fill them up, leave about an inch or so. Get your seeds. Tip a few out into your hand. They're very small. And we're going to take about, probably do three in each pot just to make sure we get something come up in each pot. Just make sure they're spread out. Let's move them around. About an inch in between each seed's fine. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take another pinch of compost, sprinkle it over the top of them. What you want is about half a centimetre of compost on top just to cover them up and just gently firm it down not too too much but Then I'll just spray them, give them a little spray. They need to be damp. They need to be moist at all times until they're sprouted. You need to keep them warm. So indoors on a sunny window sill is ideal. Or if you've got a greenhouse, put them in a the greenhouse. But yeah, so I will come back to these in a few days when they sprout it, and I'll show you how they're doing. Also, we're going to make sure that we label these so that we don't forget what they are, and we're going to write the date so we can 
keep track of how long they take to sprout. And tomorrow's can take anything from a couple of days to a couple of weeks to come out. Right, there we go. They're ready. And right now I'm just going to show you the seeds from the first video. Not much has happened because it's only been about three, four days since I did the last video. But I'll show you how they're going anyway. Just turn the camera around. Okay. So, the honeydew melon. We don't have anything coming up out of there yet. <laughs> the sweet corn, however. Quite a few of them. Have sprouted, which is good. Sweet corn again, sweet corn. Yeah, you can just see it there in the middle. Um, these ones have really come on the past few days. If you remember, this is the one that had just sprouted in the last video. So that's like three days. And the sunflowers. All starting to come up. This one's just the shells just come off of this one. Small sunflowers. You can see they're just poking out. And um, one of the cucumber crystal lemons. One of them sprouted. The shell's not come off of it yet. Nothing from any of the other ones yet. Nothing from any of these. Uh, the broccoli. Two of them have come up. And they seem to be doing well. And these are the tomatoes which we planted today. So. Right, I'll take you out into the garden in a minute. All right, here we are outside. This is one of the rose bushes I was talking about. It's planted about a week ago. You can see the new leaves coming. So the next one. And the last one. Don't know what varieties they are. They're all different colours, so I'll keep you updated on them. And this is a new addition which I bought yesterday, so a raspberry cane. I'm not sure how well it's going to do, but I'm going to give it a go. It's got new growth on it, so that's a good sign. I'll keep you updated on that one as well. I'm just going to show you the grapevine. It just died to rain, so be very quick. I'll try and train it up over this arch. See, it's got lots of new buds coming on it. Focus. Go. I'll keep you updated on that as well. I'm going in before the heavens open. Okay, that's it for episode two of Kit's Garden. Uh, please like and subscribe if you have enjoyed the video. Uh, if you have any pointers, please let me know. And if you have any requests, please let me know. Uh, anything you want me to grow. And if you want me to show you anything like that, let just leave a comment. Uh, thank you very much for watching. See you next time.